We, you know, uh, so proud. That was a, that's the uh, title track and first single from the record, and uh, really a dear song to my heart, man. It just means a lot to me, and it's been getting great reviews in radio. Uh, a lot of people say they hear the song and it just harkens, you know, that it helps them to remember a day uh, when there were people that had to care for them before they could care for themselves. And uh, what that means to them now, now that they're out there on their own, now that they have other people and children that are dependent on them, what it means to have lived with a legacy like that. That's what I was trying to say with the song. And, uh, and the radio announcers have gotten behind it, the people that have heard it um, and, and get it, they really love it, man. And more than that, it's getting played in my hometown in Chicago. And so my dad gets to hear it. And a lot of the song is about my dad and my mom, man. And so I just know they're beaming with pride when they hear that tune and they know that the, the example they left for me is one that inspires some music, some music out here right now. In terms of uh, pressure related to recording the next CD, yeah, of course, there was, there was some pressure because, you know, there was some expectations set based on the results that we got from the first record. So you got some people that are, you know, looking to see, hey, can, can they repeat that success? Can they do it again? But to be honest with you, it's something I've, I've really prayed about and tried to ignore as we move forward with the process. My main goal has just been, I want to reveal what God wants revealed in this moment, in this season. I want to be a, ve a vessel for that without sounding too self-important or anything like that. I just believe that God has called me to this moment to be a witness to what he wants to say in the kingdom. And my prayer is that this record is, is accomplishes that as much as, as possible. Yeah, in terms of um, breaking records or, or exceeding or meeting the sales that, that that Just Love meant, I don't think about that. I don't think about that at all. I, I, especially when I consider that a lot of those things that happened with, with Just Love, that was God's favor. And uh, favor in terms of putting me with the team, like Music World, putting me with people like uh, Uncle G from Uncle G Promotions and Gwendolyn and Quinn and, and the producers I've worked with, like Stan Jones and, and the great songwriters I've worked with who gave me the opportunity to put the, the best work out there that people needed at the time. Uh, I couldn't control that. That's what God put that together. And I'm pray prayerful that that's what he's doing this time. But again, I think God decides what's going to be lifted up. And so I'm just praying that this is, it brings enough value to the table that it's worth having a light shined on it where people want to tell other people about it and, and go out and buy it. Getting closer